Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. Now that we've done all the moons in the game, and we have the gold sail on the Odyssey, let's start off by probably heading over to the Moon Kingdom. Because after beating, uh, after getting every single moon and putting them into the Odyssey, a another Bowser painting has appeared at the the cathedral thing. The wedding hall, that one. So we're going to take a look at that. I don't know what's different about it though. Because it's the same end of the game thing. But I, I guess it's harder somehow. And I don't know why exactly. So we're going to head into this. I'm going to pay as much attention as possible to figure out What's happening? It does look differently colored. I'm guessing if there's any kind of difference, it's probably no health drops. If anything. Oh, and it starts off straight away with fire. I don't know if it did that normally though. Jump. Jump again. Oh my goodness, jump again again. Okay, it is a little bit different, I'm pretty sure. Just a little bit. Okay. Oh, get it. Nope. Ah. That's the f that, uh, that rarely happens where I miss the hat that I'm supposed to be getting. But I was missing a lot earlier. Oh my goodness, that was close. Donkey Kong 64! Two jumps again. Oh, another one. So this is slightly different, but it's still fairly simple. Just have to jump more. I'm guessing this phase is also going to be different now that we're on a second... second Bowser Flames. Oh, it is different. Very different. It seems mostly the same, but different side, I guess. Okay, here we go. See if I can actually get this done properly. There we go. Grab that. Okay. Oh, different. Jumping so much. There's a lot of room for error, I guess. But there we go. And then we died. Also, it's probably somewhat worrying that the moon's exploding. Something? Collapsing? Oh hey, we get a life up heart from doing that, I guess. Also, I'm pretty sure this section is still the same as it was at the end of the game. In this particular painting version. Fireball, 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 fireballs, and then slash. I think there might be a few more rocks falling this time, maybe? 
Also, this part is just really cool. Oh my goodness. I love this part. Especially with the music. Well, I guess one thing that that's different is this picture we get for completing that. But I think the only other thing that was different was the boss fight. The moonscape is pretty much the same though. But this is a nice picture to have after all that we just went through. Hey look, there's Bowser on the roof. Ah, oh, very nice. But anyway, now that that's done, I guess there's not that much else left to do. There are still a few, definitely a few things that we're going to take a look at. So starting off, I'm going to head over to the darker side and I'm going to see if I can get that shortcut to work. Which is probably going to take a few attempts, so I'm probably going to cut to that. Also, something else that's interesting is these cannons in the lava have the soup in them instead of magma. Okay, I'm back. So this is attempt number one. Now, I don't know exactly how I did this the first time I actually got this to work. I'm not sure if you actually need to use the, the updrafts to go further or if you need to actually just go straight. So I'm going to start off by going straight and hopefully that will work out okay going straight is not working so far just keep shaking just keep shaking just keep shaking I think this is working by just shaking but I don't think I'm going as far as I should be. I'm pretty sure I should be higher than this. Oh my goodness. Nope. Attempt number three. Camera locked, no touching left control stick. It also might be possible that you have to do an amazing cap throw dive jump at the very end. This is slightly off course because of going in a straight line from where it was positioned. It's slightly not centered, which is strange. There we go! Oh my goodness! That's how you skip that bit. You have to be... You have to capture the thing. Don't touch the camera or the control, left control stick. Don't touch either control stick. Press the camera uh, automatic like, center thing. And then just shake and do an amazing dive at the end. I'm, I'm glad that didn't take long, and I'm glad that I actually got to record me doing that skip for the first time, because... or the second time. Well, second time doing it, it's the first time recording it, because it's, it's a cool trick. And it means you can skip that underground section, which is a... which... that underground section by itself makes this the hardest level, but without that, it makes it a lot easier. So the darker side is a lot easier if you can do that skip. Anyway, that's the darker side glide skip. I don't know if that's a thing that other people have ever seen before. And I hope that it gets used 
by other people, like even in speedruns or something. It might already be used in speedruns, but I don't watch speedruns, so I don't really know. But anyway, now that we've done that, it's time to set sail. Because we have some more hint art that we can do. Starting off, let's actually look at that. So, whenever you've been playing Super Mario Odyssey, I don't know if this is actually a thing anymore, but whenever you've been playing Super Mario Odyssey, uh, in the news, it gave me a whole bunch of hint art, which are in the posts <laughs> back from 2018, wow. But anyway, we have quite a few of these hint arts. These don't actually give moons. Uh, we'll be looking at what they do though, so let's get started with this one and figure that out where that is in the Cap Kingdom. This place looks so different after the end of the game because the flying ships are there now. I like, I'm pretty sure I pointed that out, out before, but also it's, it's pretty cool. So where we need to go is off the edge of this tower thing. We've been on this little out thing over here. But this is where we need to go, so let's hop down. We could use a Goomba, but I'm just going to drop down. Now let me look at that hint art again. Just to make sure I'm getting this right. Okay, so it's a little bit north of the center. So if I ground pound here in the right spot, if I can find it. We get a Pixel Luigi, who gives us some coins. It's a cool Pixel Luigi reference. This is a normal Mario game, uh, uh, I guess secret hint. What's it called? I don't even know. It's a cool, cool thing. But anyway, so these give us Pixel Luigis to find, so let's head on to another kingdom and take a look at some more of those. We're going to go through all of those in this video. Hopefully I haven't actually missed any because I haven't seen any... I hope I have all of them because I don't think they are in every kingdom. But they are in most of them, so I'm going to find the ones I have written down. So the Cascade Kingdom. This one's a little bit tricky, probably, if I can, if I can't find it. So let me look at the hint art quickly. This one, uh, which one is it? That one. He's wanting us to find a specific, uh, like, point underneath a bullet bill with those other markers, which are on the blocks that break around the place. So if they broke those pieces, then we can't find it, basically, but it's, uh, it's probably not going to be too hard to find if I can actually find it. I think I know where it is, if I am not mistaken about that and I'm not thinking about a moon. I could be thinking about a moon, but I'm pretty sure we would have had that moon by now if it was, so maybe it's not. Maybe it is actually where I thought it was. So I think where it is, is actually by the pixel cat peach, probably. Unless this is it. It's not here, is it? No. Yeah, this is going to be the entire thing of me just being lost and trying to find this thing. Probably. There's one there, but I don't think that's what... With the, I don't think that connects with the rest that I'm trying to look for. Same with that one. Okay, no, this doesn't have the marks that I thought it would. So maybe it's over here with these ones. Probably is. Just need to figure out uh, where the the correct bullet bill is. Oh, is that it? I think this is it. Yep, there it is. I don't know if it gives you more coins if you cappy throw into it, but it might give it you coins faster. It does give you quite a few coins, which is good. So that is, that is one way to get coins. Probably not the best, though. And you have to keep finding them in it over and over and over again. You can probably leave the level and then come back to get coins from them, but you still have to do it over and over and over to get anything worthwhile from it. 
let's head over to the next kingdom. And actually, I'm gonna check quickly the hints before moving on so I can actually see where I'm supposed to go, possibly. Um... Okay, there's actually one for the next kingdom, the Sand Kingdom. So let's do that. So it's probably around the town area because that's what the hint art wants us to find. Let me just get a little bit closer and then look at the hint. Again, properly. So it's got a little bit of... It's a very shady place, but it's got two flowers next to it on the walls. I guess I could use the wall color as a marker, except I forgot what color it was now. But it's probably around this area. If I'm not wrong. I think I'm wrong. Uh-oh, I'm wrong. Send help. I'm wrong. Where are these flowers? That's a few there, but they're from the right ones. Maybe over here? No. This might be more sneaky than I'm thinking. Hang on, let me look at the hint art again, just to make sure I'm not crazy. Because I probably am crazy. Okay. It's kind of bluish green wall, I think. Oh, is this it? No. Also, this music is definitely Mario Bros, but in a different... Like, it's, it's, a, it's a Mario song, right? In a different style. If I'm not mistaken, which I could be. I'm mistaken about this right now. Oh, this is very sneaky. Right there. But anyway, that's that one. It gives us quite a few coins. Does it give us 100 coins? It might give us... Uh, maybe. I'm actually going to need to pay attention to the number that it is when I actually grab one. Before I grab it. Now, I'm definitely certain there's one in the Lake Kingdom. There's definitely one. I actually pointed out at some point, I'm pretty sure, that there was something for us to find if we were looking closely. You wouldn't really know it's there unless you were specifically looking for it, though, and had the hint art for it. But it's a very well-placed thing. I mean, that design was there from probably the beginning. But anyway, if we stand here and look at the ground, and then look, go, go look at the hint art, Which one is it? That one. We can see... Mario written on the ground. In the hint art. And also... On... The ground here. It's a little bit... Difficult for me to see it properly, but I think... I can kind of see it? I don't know. I'm going to look at the hint art again and try to compare it. It's probably easier for me, or for you to see it in the... Oh, I see. That's how it's supposed to look. It's probably easier to see in the edited version of the video. Okay, I, I see it. I see it now. But anyway, we need to ground pound in the middle of the... Oh, for the pixel Luigi. Okay, that's definitely a lot of coins. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that just gave us 200 coins. So it's worth getting Luigi then, somewhat. But it's still a lot of work to go in and out. Next Kingdom, let me think. Do I know where the Pixel Luigi is in the Next Kingdom? Let me look at the hint arts again. Um, 
Um, yes, okay. I just can't remember when I've, what I've looked at already. And it's super confusing. But anyway. Let's head on over to the summit path. It's probably the best point to go from. And now, if we jump off of here, I actually know this one fairly well. So I can probably do it somewhat well, since I know where it is. If I'm not wrong slightly. Okay, well, we've got this wall here, which is the wall in the thing. So let's break this open. That's where it is there, if we can get up there. So let's just break what we need, and then probably just head up there. 1701 coins. Nineteen oh one, so it it does give you two hundred coins. Okay. I'm just gonna assume there's one in each kingdom. <laughs> I should probably just look at the hint art as soon as I go to another kingdom. Instead of look at it, go back to the game, find where it is, and then go back to the hint art and then back to the game again. Cloud Kingdom. It's also interesting that there's a pixel of Mario, Peach, uh, Luigi, and Rosalina. But like, out of all of them, you don't really see... Uh, you, you see all but Rosalina, basically. We've seen Luigi in each kingdom, just around the, the things, you know. Um, so this one, I'm pretty sure is this. So we have BC and 3, 4 are the points in the map that line up with it. If I actually stay in the map. So BC 3, 4 is over there. That's an interesting spot. But anyway, let's head over there then. Try to... Oh, it's a lot higher up than I realized. I guess it's off, like, right at the edge of this somewhere. Like here? Yeah, perfect, wow. Very nice. Okay, next kingdom. Lost kingdom, I believe. Do I remember? The answer is no, obviously. I've been wanting to show that, um... The, the darker skip for ages. I've told a few people about it, but I haven't actually been able to show it to anyone other than them, I guess. wanted to just have it open for anyone to see. Now, let me look at the hint art for this kingdom. Oh, I actually should have remembered this one. This one's super obvious. Oh my goodness. What is- what- what- how did I not think? You know? How did I not think? This one is obviously over here where we got Cappy back. Also, I'm pretty sure the, the bird vulture thing still steals Cappy if you're not careful. Possibly, but anyway. Ah, uh, so is this the spot? Or is it a cross? It's probably a cross. Yep, there it is. Very nice.
Okay, Metro Kingdom. I'm pretty sure this one's a little bit obvious and also difficult at the same time. So let me see if I can actually figure this one out. Because I remember having trouble with this one. So, let's go ahead and open up the album. And I'm not sure if I'm actually at the right spot right now. But we have this New Donk City icon thing. And I need to ground pound, I believe, on the moon part of it. That's going around the icon thing. But I don't think this is it because there's no... Oh, hang on. This is it right here, isn't it? No, nope, the words probably don't line up properly with what I'm looking for. I don't think it's this either. It doesn't say New Donk City at the top. So I think I had trouble with the right position last time I was doing this. It's possibly over here. Maybe. Maybe not. Uh, where would... Why would it say New Donk City on the ground? Let me look at the hint art again. Just make sure it's not the one that is curved, curved at the front of the tower. I wonder. The game does some tricky stuff sometimes, but I don't... I don't think it's... Yeah, no. Let's keep looking. I don't think it's up here. I could possibly see what I'm looking for from up here, maybe. No. Maybe I should take, um, use some of the binocular things. So I can look around a little bit. Because that looks like a good spot for where it might be, but it's not because it doesn't have the right words above it. The tower has it on the, like, the front there, but not quite. And it has to be on the ground, I'm pretty sure. Which makes things very specific. Oh, I wonder if it's in a secret area. Which is probably strange. But I think it's in the... Dinosaur one, maybe. If I'm not crazy. Hang on, let me check. Nope, it's not down here. That's a shame. So where... Where... Where does it say New Donk City? On the ground. That's basically what I need to know, is where does it say New Donk City on the ground? But I can't think of anything. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's on one of these, yep, there, in the pool. Of course it's in the pool. Where else would it be? Ground pound there. Hello, Pixel Luigi. Give me those coins and these coins. Guess grab that as well. In the pool, of course. Yep, anyway, next kingdom.
Okay, so Snow Kingdom one is probably a little bit more specific. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay then, so that's where that is. Which means there's a ring of coins in the water. And I think it's this specific one over here because... Oh, but it has to have the right shadow for the, um, the vine that gets grown somewhere. I think there are... There's only one place that you grow a vine. Let me grow the vine. So I have the shadow to work with. It means I have to get the seed though. Where did I... Where's the, the thing? Where's the, the seed to plant? For the vine. Is it over here? Or is it somewhere else? Oh, it is over here. Cool. Literally, it's in ice. It's very cool right now. Oh, wow. It just went straight down and I'm in the water now. So let's go plant this. Oh, get up there. Grow that. And watch the shadow. Oh, it's going that way. No wonder I couldn't get it to give me the the Pixel Luigi over that the other ring of coins. Hang on, let me look at the picture before I freeze. Um Okay, it's on the shadow. Next to the rings. Oh, hello, Pixel Captain Toad. That's interesting. Can't really see him that well from over here. But that's definitely a Pixel Captain Toad. The water is just not helping right now. That's cool. Anyway, let's go to the next kingdom. Which is the Seaside Kingdom. Oh my goodness, what is wrong with me? I shouldn't have rushed. I feel like Seaside Kingdom was one that was easy, if I'm not wrong. I feel like it was easy. Okay, so let's have a look at it. It's... Oh, it's a... Oh, never mind. This one's going to be interesting. Also note that the purple coins are upside down. Which means this entire picture is upside down. And that's why the, the seaweed stuff looks like it's up right side up, because it's upside down. Okay, well, it narrows it down, having it be... I have the purple coins there because I'm pretty sure only one of those sides has the purple coins. So I should be able to get there fairly well. Also, I missed the blue sky here. I know the sunset is great and all, but still, I like the blue sky with the sea. The seaside kingdom. So let's see which thing it is here. Is it this one here? There is the purple coin thing, so it has to be around here somewhere. But also, I don't know what exact side it was on. Also, I'm going to be in trouble when I run out of air. Kelp. Oh, I can actually use... So it's on the far side. It's on over here. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. This is such a dangerous place. These enemies do not let up. <laughs> they will mess you up. Oh, and their feet. I just saw their little feet. They have like four little feet things. Okay, let's grab this. I pro probably can grab the Pixel Luigi with this. Oh, also I need to remember that it lines up with this mound. If I'm not wrong. Or this mound. No, it has to be... Has to be this mound, right? Hang on. Hint art again. Yeah, we can see the mound. And also the... 
Oh. I'm silly. The mound's on the ceiling. Why did I think it was on the ground? That's that's what that's how they get you. The mound's on the ceiling. There it is. Very nice. Also, what happens if I just do this? It gives me coins very slowly. It's spawning a lot of those things though. Anyway, next kingdom. Which should be luncheon. And I actually know where this one is. I just have to figure out where exactly it is in that spot. So, this one is in a little bit of a awkward spot, to be honest. If we look at it, it's on the pillar, very close to the end of this area here. So, we could go there with a Potaboo to make this easy. But I'm just going to walk across like this. Up until the end, and also, please don't fall off, Mario. Oh my goodness, how did I grab that ledge? Okay, so it's not this one. No mind, it is this one. <laughs> nice. I'm glad that one didn't take long, because I was expecting to have more trouble getting to it. Next kingdom, the Lost Kingdom. No, what's it called? Ruined Kingdom. It's the Ruined Kingdom. I know what I'm talking about. The, the Pixel Luigi's are probably more useful to have as you go through the game rather than at the very end, but I just... I didn't really see a good time to actually do it. I thought it'd be better to do it after all doing all the other hint art in the game first. Just to show how the whole thing works. And set aside the ones that are... Um... Pixel Luigi's and the ones that are Power Moons. Anyway, so we have... This one here, and it's on top of one of the scratches in the arena. So let's go do that. It's probably this one right here. Just on the edge of the ring. Oh, hello, Pixel Toad. Captain Toad. Give me your coins. That's really cool. Also, I, look, I like looking at this tower with the dragon here, because it means you can see its wings out the side of the, the building, which looks really cool. Next stop. Bowser Kingdom, I'm pretty sure. If There's been a moon in every kingdom so far. No, a pixel person in every kingdom so far. So there should be one in the Bowser Kingdom. But where? Let's look at the hint art straight away. Which one? Hang on. What? I, I missed one. <laughs> there's two in the Luncheon Kingdom. Uh, never mind. Oh, and there's not a second one in the, the... 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 There's a second one in the... The... The Metro Kingdom as well. How did I miss those? Anyway. Also, I think there aren't any in... Oh, there's one on the moon. Ah, uh, I'm just messing it all up. Anyway, this one is close to the end, next to the Bowser statue thing. It's breathing fire. 
So let's go get that then. Way over here is probably a good start. So it should be just over here. Which is from the Poochie. Now where exactly is it? I need to ground pound in the right spot, but where is the right spot? I feel like it's closer. No, it's further. Don't change the camera game. Oh my goodness. I'm angry at the camera changing itself when I just changed it. There it is. It's closer to the statue than I thought it was. But anyway, let's go to the moon and then let's go to the um, the two kingdoms that I missed the second ones in them. And then there's one more after that. So I almost got through all of these pixel Luigi and pixel Captain Toad places. Which, which water did I say I was going to do them in? I don't know. But anyway, Moon Kingdom. This one's actually a very, very, very tricky one. So if we have a look at it. Uh, that one. You might think that those coordinates on the side are actually where you need to go. And then that the, the picture of the ring is where on the ring you need to hit it. And the church is like where you can see the church from. But nope, it's actually a lot more... Uh... It's very clever. So if we go to our map, we don't go anywhere. We look at the side over here, and we can see the picture of the church that was over there, the locations of it, and a picture of where it is. It's on this ring here, at this specific point. Very... That's, that's a really cool, cool way of doing that hint, because it makes you think, where can you see the church from at that position? But no, it's over, over here. Just to be tricky. There he is. And there we go. Oh, you can break those? I didn't realize you could break those. Anyway, let's go to another kingdom. Probably the luncheon to start off. Actually, we could go... My brain is thinking. I have an idea of what to do right now. Let's go to... Let's go to the Metro Kingdom. If I'm not crazy. I'm pretty sure this will work. So... From here, let's go down. And let's have a look at the hint art that we missed. One of them. This one... is... Expresso... and, and K. Rule... or Cool... on a... specific... cross... thing. And as we should know, some of these streets have names... like that. So this one's Expresso... going this way. And this one, if I can f see the sign, is K rule. So, hang on. I know it's here somewhere. There it is. The pixel Luigi is just in the middle of the road, between these two roads. So there we go. That's one of the ones we missed. Now I think I can actually go. To the next two kingdoms that I need to go to by using the paintings actually. Which will make things slightly faster question mark, except that I have to go through a world that I didn't actually need to go through. So it's probably about the same amount of speed, but it's gonna take me close to where I need to be anyway. Probably? Never mind. Just ignore me. So if we go down here, we can jump over to this painting, 
and go to actually where we need to be. In the Luncheon Kingdom. Need to warp away though. So, let's head over to this one island way over here. And if I'm not mistaken, this is where I'm supposed to be, so... Let's... Try to figure this out. Look at this picture. Because we can see where that is. And we can't actually see the, uh, the pixel thing on the ground here. But we can tell that it's right next to this spot here. So that's ground pound there, and there's the Pixel Luigi. Right underneath the hole. Now the only other kingdom we have left to go is the Mushroom Kingdom, which we can access right here. Which is convenient. Go to the Mushroom Pond, I guess. That's a good spot to go from, probably. So let's have a look at this hint art as well. Well, so we have 4,204 coins now, which is pretty good considering we didn't have that many when we started this search for pixel people. Just making sure that this is the last one, which it is. Nope. I missed one again. Ha! <sighs> That's fine, I'll go back and get it. But anyway, we have this little hint out here, which is for this kingdom. And if we use that one circle as a reference for where we need to be, which is this circle here, we can see that we need to be somewhere over here, probably like right around this corner, this turning bit, maybe close to the tree. I might need to look at the hint out again. Hang on, I know what I'm doing. Also, can I just make sure that there aren't any others that I've missed? Yep, cool, we're good. Uh, let me see... this one. It is right on that edge. So maybe I need to be closer to on the road. Like right... there. So there we go. Another Pixel Luigi. So, the other kingdom we need to go back to is one we can't get to by painting, so we have to actually go by Odyssey this time. Let's go to the Lost Kingdom. And this one might be a bit difficult if I can't figure out this one too quickly. So let's go to our picture and look at it. And we need to find... Where that... Oh no, that's not going to be too difficult, but we can see that this is... The treetops from where we are right now. So let's head over this way. And it should be like right... There. Cool. So that's all the Pixel Luigi's and Pixel Captain Toads. Very nice. So we're pretty much done with this video for now, but there's one more thing I wanted to quickly show off. Which I didn't look at earlier for some reason. I should have done it. I had a look at it earlier. But on the darker side... Also I love how it's called darker side because we have the moon, and then the dark side of the moon, and then the darker side. Just... The darker -ra 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 side. When? Anyway. So, down at this party, if we head up a little bit, we did see Pauline, but we didn't actually talk to her, so let's have a look at that. And she's actually wearing Mario's cap right now. Go Mario, jump man! I'm just surprised I didn't show that she's wearing Mario's cap more than anything else. Hang on, what's that? What's that reflection? What's the reflection? 
it looks weird for many reasons anyway with that that is it for this episode of super mario odyssey so thank you all for watching and i'll see you all next time